Hey, what's going on guys? Zach Morrow with Clam Outdoors and Morrow Outdoors. So today, I'm just gonna do a quick little review on the Straight Drop by Clam Outdoors. And now, I know the guys that have been following me, I'm always meat stick, right? I've always been running the meat stick by Jason Mitchell, but you know what? That's still a good rod, but when I'm looking for a finicky, sensitive bite, this is my, no, my new go-to rod. So this weekend, I picked it up. I picked it up last week. I got to try it out this weekend. This is the 30 inch noodle. I got a little twist here. This is the 30 inch noodle. Plenty of backbone, very sensitive. And you know what? I reeled in a bass this week. I brought in a couple bass this weekend, crappies, and about a handful of bluegills ready. And I could feel the, even the smallest bite. The bluegills that were biting that are even smaller than the minnow I was running on the tip up outside my house. I could feel it on this rod. So my setup is the, this weekend that I did, and if you guys have seen my post, I was doing okay. Not as good as some of you. Be the full ant, which is another jig that's new to me. I haven't ran the ants, which I love. Is the full ant, the 30 inch noodle straight drop, and two pound monofilament in the yellow. Now, I've been watching a lot of Matt Johnson's videos, and you know what? I had to try it out for myself. And this is the money maker here. So, if you're looking for a new pan fish rod or looking to change it up, try it with a straight drop. Now the thing that was different for me is the reel is more of your fly fishing style. There's no trigger, no button to feed lying down. If you wanna do it, you control it by your hand. That's the only way to do it. So again, if you're looking for a new pan fish rod, try the straight drop by Clam. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and tell your buddies. Stay safe, always wear, wear picks and spud bar when you're going out on the ice. Stay safe guys.